When I was younger, uh, so before I came to NYU, I was always very interested in chemistry. So one day I came across two polymers, you mix them together, and it turns into a solid. My first idea was what if I could take this and put this into the field that I'm passionate about, which is medicine. Sonaris is an early stage medical device company. We make a gel that stops traumatic bleeding in seconds. For situations like a soldier being shot on the battlefield or a patient undergoing a surgery that has serious bleeding involved. What we do is we take plant-derived polymers and we break them down into small pieces. So if this goes onto a wound, it'll actually reassemble into your local extracellular matrix. It's really important for any company to pick a focus for what they're spending their time on. When you have a product like ours, you really can bring it anywhere. Uh, so what we did in the very beginning was just to go out and start talking with customers. We chose to pursue the veterinary market first because of our business strategy, the path of least regulation. It was easiest and quickest for us to get our product out to the veterinary market. An important part for a young entrepreneur is to find mentors and advisors to help you solve the problems that you don't know you will need to solve. What's extremely interesting about New York is that really everything, and I mean everything, is at an arm's reach. The experience and the opportunities within the, the bounds of the city are really endless just because of the sheer magnitude. And NYU really sits in the center of everything. Uh, they're able to make the connections for you. The Entrepreneurial Institute has really been great in terms of offering us advice both on our business strategy, our business presentation, and also connecting us with people who can help move us forward. And they bring a lot of good people together uh, so that instead of having to go out and you know walk through the streets of Manhattan to try to find something, you can just go sit either in a classroom or on campus and those people are brought to you.